okay guys okay guys so you can i've been making my own ornaments or revamping old ones so some of these ornaments i got last year but some are this year's all from home bargains so these are all remember these little madiga masky things this is this year's home bargains 99p this stuff i had my own but home bargains do it as well i think it's one pound something under two pounds a row uh, they had it in silver and the pink these masks were 1.99 from home bargains but as i say some of them i had last from last year so i've just revamped them into a different reef now i have one two three four five ornaments on this on this piece of garland that also I had from last year. So I've just revamped it, restyled it into my own style. And uh, so that's what you can do. So that's cost two pounds because, uh, no, four pounds to make because I only had to buy three ornaments. The rest I had here. I've also made some tassels. These are really sparkly. This is just wool that you could do with the kids. Uh, a polystyrene ball with a little tiny bobble from Home Bargains. I think these are two ninety nine a pack. So that's easy. Uh, I made this as well, the little Christmas trees. This is just an old piece of material because I used to sew stuff. So it's a piece of material I had. Uh, the little top hats. These are just cardboard. I got the template off of the internet and it's just made with cardboard, uh, old pieces of jewellery that I had lying about the house. This is from an old hair bubble thing that the kids had. Now I couldn't get the pink that I needed so this is a red bobble. It's an old bobble that I had, so I spray painted it with white paint, white gloss paint, and it came out this colour. And I've added all the little bits of bling. This one is air dry clay. As I say, these are red bobbles. Now these, believe it or not, If you've got kids and looking for easy entertainment, is two Pringle lids, believe it or not, with a piece of ribbon to glue on to hold them together and some beads, which I had a moustache anyway. And my tree topper this year is Barbie Remount. She's absolutely beautiful. She's really sparkly. The camera, I don't see the camera's not picking it up. But that's just a, a piece of that teal stuff. The underneath I've made go hard and it's just a piece of old piece of sheet. And I've dipped it in a PVA glue and wrapped it around a little cone shape. Just to keep her in the, her wings. Let me see her wings up there. Oops, sorry. If you see her wings, her wings are home bargains. Uh, two decorations glued together with hot glue. And my revamped posts has come on kindly. Made the post for me. It's just a post and a piece of wood screwed together and some old decorations. These were hatch, they were light brown and I've painted them white with just some white paint I had lying about. And my, this is just a vase. These, again, I had these my own vases, full of lights. I've still to do the plenty bit. I don't know what I'm going to do with that yet. And my little soldiers, believe it or not, there's a blue one and a pink one are made from the spindles of a chair. Again, come and cut them for me. 
as I say, I've been doing these decorations because I'm off work just now. I've hurt my back and I can't do very much. So the wreath that I've made is just on a wreath form with some sparkly bob uh, pom poms. And this you could make is just pieces of material cut up and tied on they originally they are tied on to a uh, white wool and i've just made it as long as i needed it and wrapped it around the reef made a bow put some bubbles on from home bargains these are just hot glued on so that's the start of my christmas decorations this year